Welcome to Aorus 101. Have you ever wondered why every AI image generator tool looks so different? Now, there's a better way to do it. Introducing Gmate Creator, a tool built by Gigabyte. It connects to different AI models and keeps everything in one easy to use interface. That means you don't have to learn a new interface every time and you don't have to worry about models being old or outdated. Now, let's see how to use Gmate Creator. First, open the Gmate on your Gigabyte laptop. On the left-hand side, you'll see the Apps icon. Click on it, then select Gmate Creator, and it will launch right away. Please note, Gmate Creator is currently supported on newly released Gigabyte laptops from 2025 only. When you open Gmate Creator for the first time, there's just one quick setup. You'll need to enter something called a Hugging Face token. Hugging Face is the world's largest platform for AI models. It gives you access to the latest and most powerful ones. The token works like a password or a key. It connects Gmate to Hugging Face, so you always have access to the latest models. To get your token, go to the Hugging Face website and sign up for an account. After signing up, go to your account settings. Click Access Tokens from the left menu. Create a new token. Ensure all necessary authorizations are checked. Copy the token and paste it into Gmate Creator. Important, your token is personal. Keep it safe and don't share it. Once connected, you're ready to go. Gmate Creator comes preloaded with popular models such as Stable Diffusion and Flux. Each model has its own style and strengths. Currently, you can only use AI models listed in Gmate Creator. Please keep in mind, model files can be large, so make sure you have a stable internet connection. Keep your laptop plugged in and ensures that you have sufficient storage space available for the download. If you see an error when downloading, it's probably a permission issue. Click the model name. It will take you to the model's webpage on Hugging Face, follow the authorization instructions there, and you'll be all set. Now, let's take a look at the Creative Workspace. On the right, you'll see the prompt box. This is where you describe the image you want the AI to create. In the left, you'll find some built-in style and effect to guide your image's tone or mood. Just click one to apply it instantly. Underneath the prompt box, there's the negative prompt box. This helps you tell the AI what to avoid, like no text or no blur. You can also use the built-in presets to make this part easier. Scroll down and you'll find advanced settings. Seed is a random number that changes the result. Use the same seed to get a similar image. Steps means how many times the AI refines the image. More steps equals more detail, but slower. Width and height, this sets your image size. Bigger images take more time. Number of pictures, how many images you want to generate at once. Prompt word, relevance. This controls how closely the AI follows your prompt. Higher numbers equals more control. Lower equals more freedom. Different models may behave a little differently. Feel free to play around and see what works best for you. Let's try it out. In the prompt box, try to type Cyberpunk City. Click the Generate button. After a few seconds, Gmate will show you a cool sci-fi city image. You'll also see where the image is saved. Click the folder icon to open it right away. That's it for today's tutorial. Gmate Creator, integrated with Hugging Face, enables you to run powerful AI models directly on your laptop. Whether you're just starting out or already experienced, Gmate's simple interface helps you create awesome images fast. Got questions? Want more tutorials? Leave a comment and let us know. See you next time.